and today we are geocaching. I have Bruno with us in the truck, so I got him in air conditioning, so he's okay. <laughs> he's math, but we just stopped here. This is our first event here, and Shaber's up there looking for it right now, so it's supposed to be in here. So he's got the, the map, and that's what he's trying to do, is figure it out. Hmm? So we'll look and see. See where it is. Follow him because he's got the map. Huh, there's water over there. Huh, interesting. Did you find it? I don't know. It should be right in here. It's supposed to be in a tree stone. Huh. Looking. Hey, looking. It's supposed to be in a tree stump. So, mm, I don't think it's in there. Mm -mm. Mm. I don't see anything in that little hole. So. Alright, so instead of you being bored, why are we looking? I'm going to turn you off, and if we find it, I'll bring you right back. I'm looking in here, seeing if there's anything here. Okay. And sometimes, you know, we have, what, I think there was one maybe we didn't find. But pretty much we find them all. <coughs> so, I'll turn you right back on. That way at least somebody can know that they found it, because I know this is it. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and log this one, we'll go on to the next one. Okay guys, so we didn't find the item, but we found the stump, so we're going to move on, and we left a key there, so somebody else tries to do this, they got something in there. Um, for whatever reason, it's not there. But that's the stump, so we're going to go back to the truck, and we're going to go to the next one, so stay tuned. Okay guys, so we are here on the next one that says the clue is that it's in the name. So it is pine tree, we think. So we're looking for a pine tree. That's what we're doing. 
Say hi to Bruno. Hi, hi Bruno. <laughs> yeah. He wants to come, but then he doesn't want to come, so I don't know. So here we are looking. And he's got a tree, a pine tree, I think. No? I don't think these are pine trees. These are like oak trees in here. That's a palm tree. So, there's a liquor bottle. I think this is right on it right here. Yeah? A palm tree? No. It says goat. Palm. What's the first name? Goat. Goat. G-O-A-T, goat. So we think it's right in here somewhere. So we'll be back if we find it. Hold on. Yeah. Said it's in the name, and the name is Goat Pine. So, and there it is. Ah, oh, you found it. Oh, there look it how is. tiny it is. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> cool beans. Hmm. All right. So. Let's take us up to the truck. All right. So that's a pretty cool hint. Yeah. I didn't even notice that tree. I went right by it. soaking wet. Uh -huh. Hopefully it stayed dry in here, but it doesn't look like it. Yeah. No, somebody didn't seal it all the way. Hmm. We don't have a piece of paper in there, do we? No. Alright. What is today's date? Um, 25th or 26th? 26th today. 26th? Yeah. Alright guys, we're going to log us in and... Let's see if I got something that'll fit in here. We're gonna leave a little treasure for someone else, and I'll be back with you when we start going to the next one. Okay. Now, what'd you say it was? 26? Yeah. Yeah. Okay guys, so we found it. He's going to sign it and put it back and we'll continue to the next one. Okay guys, we're at the next one and it looks like it might be on the walkway. So we're going to take Bruno with us on a walk. I don't know how far we have to go down, maybe not too far. But as soon as he settles down and we can go find it, I'll turn you back on. Between palms. Well, there's a palm over here, there's a palm here, and then you have these palms right down here. And they're too close together. So, I would think it's somewhere in here. That's what I would think. It's not letting me do what I want to do. Bruno's being a bad puppy today. He's excited. That's the problem. He gets too excited. Alright, so as soon as we find it, I'm going to turn you back on. There you go, guys. I found it. It is right down here in between the two palms, just like they said. And there it is. 
Yay! Found it, monkey, good job. Anki found it. There you go. So we're gonna open it up. I give it to Shea Bear because I got the dog. So it makes it harder for me to do anything. So, and he can open it up. And then we'll see what we've got. Okay. Geocaching. Congratulations, you found it. Internationally or not. It's part of a worldwide game called geocaching. Okay, it's just talking about, it's just explaining what geocaching is. And there's this. Can I see? 24. Fourth World Scout Jamboree. Oh, cool. From the Boy Scouts. North America 2019. Oh, cool. So that's cool. Mm-hmm. We've got this. Keychain. It says Pura Vida. Yeah, Spanish, I think. And then there's this as wet. It's a scout thing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, cool. Very cool. Okay. I've got a business card. Mm hmm A little bell. How cute. Mm -hmm. A little guy with googly eyes. Mm -hmm. And an owl. Which yeah. is neat because we have so many owls here. Okay, so oh, very now nice. we're, we're going to sign our book. This thing's damp. Yeah, we've had so much rain. But anyway, we're going to sign the book and log this one in, and we're going to head on to the next one. So stay tuned. Cool. Okay, guys, so. Like he said, we're going to sign and go. So, hold on. We'll be back. Okay, guys. We are at this park. Now, we have been here before when we geocached, but we went in the other entrance. This is right here is this side of the park. So, we eat at that restaurant right there, and it's very good. That's our favorite restaurant. So anyways, we can park here and we can go down in here and go into the trails. The thing is, it's getting very dark as you can see way back there. So hopefully we can do this and we went to Jersey Mike's and got us a sandwich so we could sit out here and enjoy it. So hopefully the rain won't come this way. So we're praying. Anyways. Off we go. We're going to go to the next one, and as soon as we get there, we will shoot you back on. I'm just going to show you the trail that we're going to go on, and it's pretty in here. And they have all kinds of trails. As you can see, it's a 2.3 mile trail, the, the yellow one, and that's this one right here. So they have different ones, so that's pretty cool. It's not really that far from the house either. I should bring Bruno out here once in a while and get him walking. So maybe he won't be so rambunctious. So as soon as we find it, we'll be back. Is downed tree, okay? And under the description it says it's off of the Blue Trail and Whispering Pines. We're on the Blue Trail right now. Mm -hmm. We're on this trail right here. And it says you're looking for a small Rubbermaid container. Watch out for flying discs. Now, if you guys look, you guys know what the flying discs are, right? I do. Frisbee golf. We call it crawl. Crawl. You know how, but you can see, there's the down tree, and watch out for flying discs. Discs. Yes. So, we're going to head over here. See if monkey can find it. Okay. I'm ready. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. 
camera on. Sand. Hmm. It's saying it's that. What? I'm just reading. It's saying it's that way 169 feet. Hmm. Okay, we're here at this thing. That's not it. Okay, it says down tree, watch out for flying discs, but according to this, mm -hmm. it's saying it's 167 feet that way. So we're going to keep looking. Huh. We just got here. Hey, Monk, see if there's anything on the, on the other side of this log. Okay. Okay, so as soon as we find it, I will turn you back on. Okay, so we're, he's getting closer, he says, so I turned you back on so you could see where we're going. There's another log that's down. So he didn't find it. Uh -uh. I'm going to go out this way so I don't struggle. So we'll see what it's doing. I thought it was near the flying disc with the downed tree there, but it seems to be a lot further than we think. So it could be a. Yeah, another downed tree. Okay, so we'll look. That? That don't look natural. No. Uh uh. Does it? No. I see it. You see it? Yeah. All right. I see cool. it. Yeah. Alright, let me get you guys set up. Here. Wow, this well, is a big one. Get that out of there and then... This is a big one. Ooh. This is fun. I like doing stuff. Okay. Like this. Well, you know what? We know where it is. Let's go over to that bench over there. Okay. And we'll sit down, and eat our sandwich, and do our thing. Okay. And then I'll bring it back. All right. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys. Here we go. We're gonna open this up because the clouds and the wind is picking up over here. So. Here we go. Remember, I'm monk. All right. Here we go. Maybe. Ooh, wow. Cool beans. Oh, I got a postcard. Have an amazing 2021 happy catching. Matt and P84. And Jessica, happy new year, Lee Ann. Okay, where's, where's that from? It's, it, this is it, Bluestone State Park. Yeah. Bluestone State Park, Hilt, Hinton, West Virginia. That's cool. That is cool. Okay, we got all kinds of little knickknacks. This is not openable, so you can just look at it the way it is. A little cross and stuff. Yeah, there's little knickknacks. These things are, I think, that's um, dye or sand. No, I mean... That's what that yeah. is. Okay, okay, cool. Yeah. That's and for the kids. We have another one you in here. You can take them for two. kids, but we'll leave them because we're not kids. Anymore. Right. Okay, that's your pad. That's your pad. Okay, eraser. And a tee. Golf tee. Mm-hmm. And another eraser. And we got some cards here. This is a magic card. And here's another magic card. Yep. And we got 
a lot of Mickey Mouse. We've yeah. seen those before. And a little roller skater. And there's some more Mickey Mouse. And there's a coin. Uh, one of the fake coins. And a little fake coin. Cool. Alright, I'm going to sign us in and yep. log us in. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to put a little key in there. Here, Monk. Okay. Here, you want to put a key in it? Yeah. Okay, we brought... Actually, this is our fourth one today. So. Do the blue one. Do the blue one? Yeah. All right. blue Put one. a key in there? Yep. All right, I'm going to sign us in, log us in, yep. and I'll be back with you. Cool beans. That was fun. We'll be back. Okay, guys, we have finished eating, and we're going to find another geocache. So we're going down here. And I think it's just so pretty in here. I should bring Bruno out here and go walking. I can't bring my mom here because it's not sturdy enough. There's a lot of rocks and little hills and stuff. A lot of twigs, so she'd probably fall on me. So, are we close? No, we need to go that way. Oh, we got to turn around. Okay. Probably should just went straight on that one trail. Oh, really? I said we probably should have, but this thing was taking me this way. Oh. I think this one loops around like one big, one circle, small circle. Well, this is just a, <clears throat> you can't get lost in here. Yeah, no, you can't. No. Ooh, here we go. Uh -huh. That's surrounded by roads. Yeah. I mean, it's a big set of woods, but you can't get lost. Right. Okay, so when we find it, I will turn you back on. Hey, these are cool. Look at these guys. I don't know what they are. They're pretty cool, kind of spongy looking. Kind of like an ear plant, I think. But it's on the ground. Pretty neat. So anyways, Shea Bear's way up there. He just keeps going and leaves me in the middle of nothing. So I have to catch up to him. I'll be right back. This is pretty cool. The so, last clip, we were way out there. Yeah. There's all kinds of squirrels in these trees. Loving it. Ooh, it's gorgeous out here. So, really nice. We're saying we're 400 feet this way. So, you know, uh, if uh, monkey can get down here, uh, <laughs> or not. But. Whew. Do we have to climb again? No. We just got to get down here. Yeah. Okay. Stay tuned. We'll see if I fall or not. Ah. Alright. So. <laughs> I think this is it right yeah. here. And that was way off compared yeah, way to where off. your your directions were. But I believe there that's it, it. Yep. That's it. Right there. Yeah. And it's saying. I'm going to pick it up. Okay. Okay. It's saying we're 36 feet that way. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Whoop. All right. so that was pretty good. I mean, he still had to think. I just ran into it because I've seen this blue thing down here on the ground. Yeah. And I wanted to know what it was. And I looked, and there was the bottle. Okay. So it's pretty good. All right, we're going to bring it over here. Yeah. We're bringing it out so he can sign it and stuff. There you go guys, so I ran out of battery so I had to switch my battery so I don't know how much you got, but that's how many we have done, right? It's yes, 15. The smiley face. Yeah, the smiley faces is what we've done. And we did get this one. I hope that you saw where I found it. So it was clearly yeah. by luck. Yeah, it was clearly by luck. Because that feet off. that blue thing right there on the ground, that hopefully you can see that it was just beyond those two trees over there. So I just happened to see it sitting there. Some people move them on purpose. Yeah, they do. They shouldn't. But they no. Do, but it 
No, you put it back where you find it because, you know, they, they do have clues and, and stuff. So you want people to find them. Yep. You, you know, it, it's for fun. Yep. And, you know, some people, yeah, they do change and move things. They do it on purpose just to be nice, you know, make it hard. Right. Which I'm all up for a challenge, but, you know, yeah. I mean, some people... You know, like it had us right there. Uh huh. Yeah. And then we were over we here. Found it, it said we was 30 feet. Well, 60, 59 feet that way. Yeah. And then it said we were 60 feet this way, 30 <laughs> feet that way. So. Yeah, you were. It was all in here when it was over there. So it was just by luck, luck, luck. So these things are really cool. It's like an air plant only on the ground. They're really neat. I don't know their names or anything, but if anybody knows, um, put a message in the comments below. So, hmm, anybody that lives in Florida. So, I've seen them up in the trees, but not on the ground like they are. So, anyways, we're going to go to another one that's closer to the truck. Um, so, we're going to do a little walking, and then we'll get closer to it that we'll turn you back Almost on. Almost a half a mile. Half a mile. Yeah. Good to go. Oh, wow. Isn't that cool? Okay, so we're coming up here to the next hatch. This is really neat. Yeah, this is cool. Okay, we're closer to the entrance here. That's where the last cache is, is, is around here somewhere. We're not far from it, so. Are you? Yeah. So we came across this. I'm going to go up there if we can. I'm going to do an intro. Oh, so I got to shut mine off. You okay. Don't have to, just... All right. We'll be back. Okay, guys. So we found this up here and. Yeah, we are not that far from the truck. You can probably see the truck through those trees right there. So, I don't know why we didn't see it because the trail's right down here where that bench is there. And we should have seen this, but we didn't. So, this is pretty cool. Very neat. I'd like to find some information on this. If we could, maybe the Boy Scouts made this, or maybe well, it's it, been here. It could be, because this is all Boy Scout stuff. Yeah, yeah, the Boy Scouts come in here quite well, often. they put the park benches up and stuff. Yeah, and yeah. Scouts. Wow, look at this. Really cool. So I don't know if they did it, or if it's been here for a long time. Well, it's not super old, I see shingles. Yeah. Shingles there. So, shingles was around. Very cool. Yeah, neat. No, nothing, nothing on here indicating about it. So maybe if I Google it when I get home and I find something on it, I will um, put it in in the information there. Um, but if I don't, I'll just put a caption saying I didn't find anything about it. Um, so you guys know, but it's pretty cool. I think the Boy Scouts might have done this at one time. That's what I think. And uh, oh, that's really neat. Very cool. Yeah, see, we're in the back of the park here that we went into before, and we've been geocaching today. So um, yeah. So, anyways, this is really cool really neat. It's fun to find stuff like this, you know? It's just fun. Out in the woods and, you know, you're just having a good time. And we're getting exercise, so, because uh, we want to see how much uh, Shea Bear can do. So when we go out west, we're going to be able to, um, to uh, do this, so. And I think he'll do fine. We might have to take a lot of breaks. I'm, I'll probably have to be more break than he will. Uh, I'm more slower walker than he is, but I think this is pretty cool. Um, see, there's another trail. There's a trail over there too, and uh, you can see over there a little bit. There you go. Hopefully, you see. 
the area a little bit. And you can see the cars going by. So we're not far from anything. So this is really neat though. And uh, so I thought you guys would like this. And uh, yeah. yeah, they had shingles on here at one time. That's what I'm thinking. This was for Boy Scouts or something. So, but if I find any information on it, I'll put it in so you guys can see. Okay, so stay tuned. We are finding our other geocache. All right, guys. We say at the same time. We do that a lot, don't we? Okay, so we think this might be it. The thing keeps taking us in a circle. And, of course, we're right here. And the hint said, in the don't get stumped. Don't get stumped. So uh, This is in my next video, so stay tuned for it. So, anyways, I'll let him look and see if he sees anything. I don't see anything in it. No. So don't get stumped on it. Or around it. But, according to this... There's a brick over here. Right here. We're pretty much on it. So... It says don't, it says don't get stumped. <laughs> oh, there it is! <laughs> oh, cool! Oh, very cool. All right. All right, yeah. So it was there. Yeah. It just wasn't all the way inside. Right. That's really neat. Okay, so... Okay, so... You want to do it over here? Right here, yeah, because it's really nothing to go through on this. It's just a sign and go. Yeah. So, but I'm going to put a key in it. Oh, but there it cool. is, guys. Oh, there's a sticker. There's a little sticker in here. Oh, okay. Yeah. And there's our signing paper. There's our sticker. Okay. Yeah, cute. Yeah. Yep. So, okay. okay. All right. I'm going to sign this in, log us in, okay. and I'll be back with you. All right. Okay, guys. So, we're going to sign out, and uh, I'll be right back uh, in a few minutes. We found a fly, what do they call those? Golf frisbees? Yeah. It's a frisbee so that's pretty frisbee. cool. We found that. Monkey's going to keep it. Yeah, why not? Souvenir. Never know. That's pretty cool up there. Uh, I like that. That's neato. Yeah. Now, let's see if I can get a couple of pictures from far. Hold on. Okay guys, so we're back at the truck right here, you can see, and right behind me, well in front of me, is this thing right here. So, she Bear found something when we were geocaching that they kind of said a few things, but not a whole lot. But, there is something on this. So, I'm going to let him tell you, and I'll be quiet. Okay, there's a pipe in this. Uh-huh. Now, I found a little bit of information that there's a pipe up there. Uh-huh. This little pipe. All right. But I don't think it's a chimney because there's no open spot. Uh-huh. You know, like a fireplace. Yeah. Uh, see, there's a hole right up there, though. Like, it could have been a chimney. Huh. But what I got here is on this uh, geocache, it says... Uh, this cache will give you wings. I don't know what that means, but park on Highway 41 near the Rock Pillar. Okay. This pillar was built in the 30s as the entrance to what is now Whispering Pines Park. A quick visit to the Historical Society failed to determine what the structure this cache is near used to be, but you'll see it. It's old. So nobody really knows yet what the hell it is. Huh. But there's a big hole right up there. Yeah, yeah. I see that hole. Yeah. 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 That's really cool though. And we've sat across at the restaurant and looked at this many times to try to figure out what it was. That's what I was telling my yeah. too. Right? Yeah. And so then when we were geocaching, that's what we found on the geocache that it was in the 1930s. So that's kind of neat. Yeah. Now, why would you need a pipe in there if it wasn't for like a chimney? Oh no, it's a little tiny pipe. Huh? Yeah. It's a little steel pipe right up here. Uh huh. 
Oh, I see. Like a drain hose? And there it is. Yeah, isn't that strange? Yeah, I see. And then there's that big one on the other side. All right. But I can't see. Look, it's all the way down here. Any places where it used yeah. to be a chimney. Yeah, neat. Cool beans. Very cool. Yeah. And you can see the other side here too. Very neat. As you can tell that we're right by the highway here. So that's pretty cool. Yeah. So we don't yeah. know what the pillar used to be. No. She always kept saying we need to film that. And I'm <laughs> like, well, I really didn't want to film it without information, but since we were here And we had a little bit anyways. And we had a little built bit. I mean, yeah, said it was built in the in the 30s, so yeah, thought I'd include this. Very so cool and very interesting. Through. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So yeah. I'm going to do my now. Alrighty. I found one. This is one of those, uh... Okay, guys. So, that's it for today. I just wanted you guys to see that, and it's really pretty in here. I really like it. Um, we'll probably be back. I'd like to bring Bruno down in here, too, sometime. And it was quite fun. We had a good time. There are other geocaches in this area, and uh, so we'll do some more uh, again. And I can't wait until we go out west because we want to do this out west too a little bit. Um, so you guys don't just get bored of one thing of us going out there. So we are hoping to go soon. I can't say when yet, but it's it's coming up. So. Just uh, in time, hopefully. I'm hoping somewhere in October, but I can't say for sure because I have to make sure that my mother can be in the nursing home for a couple of weeks and I have to do something with my cat. I probably put her in a holiday place um, while we're gone. So we're really not sure when we're going to go, but we'll go soon, hopefully. So stay tuned for more videos and I hope you enjoyed this. This was fun. You should do geocaching around your area. It, it gets you together. It gets you to out and about. And you're not sitting in front of the TV set or playing games on videos and that. And it didn't rain. So it looked really dark. And I thought it was going to rain before we finished. But it didn't. It blew over where we were anyway. So I'm glad. So you guys have a good weekend. And uh, stay tuned. There's going to be plenty more. Bye, y'all. My Kasush is out.